And it is taken here by Taylor back behind his net. Played it around left wing for Gabrielson. Up the boards for Schwartz. Schwartz's pass came through the slot. Taken here by Surrey back inside of their own zone. And flipped back out there as it was kicked back inside the zone by Galata. And the Eagles break out of their own end. Seven minutes gone here in this opening period. Rolls in a pass. Left wing side. Bongo in. Takes the shot. He scores. Jake Bongo finds room on the left wing side to carry in. And Bongo finds the back of the net with a chip shot over the glove side of Justin Katz. So Jacob Bongo has the marker, his fifth goal of the season. And just like that, it's Surrey that jumps ahead and takes a one to nothing lead. Reeves in the corner, turning away from pressure. Tied up on the end boards here as he's in a healthy puck battle with Liam Hunks. Everybody coming together there with that. Off the bench, making a play as Moore Yellow. Try to get it to Duclair on the left wing side, but that will come back out to center. Fusco turns his way back up on the left wing, driving wide, trying to cut to the net. Fusco to the front of the goal. Stop, rebound, scores! Matt Fusco, a terrific net drive down the left wing side. His first try was stopped. The secondary effort is put by Pulver on the glove side. And Fusco's got his fifth goal of the season. And the Warriors tie the game. It's 1-1. So draw to the right side of the goal of Katz. The Warriors and the Eagles tied at one. West Clone again starting a four-game homestand here tonight. Playing Penticton next Friday, Salmon Arm next Saturday, and then welcome the Vernon Vipers to town Friday, November 4th, before going on the road to a desirable location in Merritt. The Warriors' first trip to see the Centennials. Centering pass by Riley Lusiak, just missing Felix Caron in the middle of the ice. And the Eagles try to bring it back the other way, a lead feed that could not connect with the forward there in Jake Bongo. Katz gave the puck away, and a chance in front is blocked by Aiden Reeves. Justin Katz turned the puck over. It looked like maybe he had an issue with his skate blade, and Reeves came back, and you can credit him with a save tonight as he stopped that puck in front as Jake Bongo tried to make his way to the front of the goal. Off the draw. It is the Warriors that will put this back inside the Surrey zone. Duclair chasing after it here to negate the icing in the left wing corner. Duclair up the boards. Left point now, Nolan Hayes walks to the middle. Left circle, Duclair moving and taking a shot. Stop, rebound, pushed off the goal line by Gabrielson, who was in a battle in front with Brennan Nelson. And we get a stoppage in play because of a hand pass. What an opportunity that was as Duclair got the puck in the left faceoff circle. Try to get it back again. The puck will come back out to center. And it's Ewan Rennie that will carry it ahead. Rennie in across the blue line, right wing side. Try to center a pass in front that was knocked away. Loose puck still in the high slot. Poked away by Lusiak, who tries to carry the other way and he will. Possible odd man rush for the Warriors. It's Lusiak down the left side, in front. Karan scores! Felix Karan right in front and a great play by Riley Lusiak who poked the puck around a Surrey defender and made his way in front and passed to the middle for Karan who beats Pulver over the glove side. It's a goal coming for... And the puck will come back below the goal and now up the left wing side here. Brassington pass ahead. Evers trying to work this back in offensively. He was tied up by Hayes who knocked him off stride. The Warriors will turn it the other way. Could be a four on two through center. Duclair pass to the middle, right wing side. Now Salandra makes a move, tried to slide it back. Loose puck in front, scores! Brennan Nelson finds the loose puck in front and backhands it through Pulver on a four on two rush inside of the offensive zone. It's Nelson that finds the back of the goal with his third of the year and two quick goals for the Warriors, has them ahead 3-1. Round the boards on the left wing, Aaron Schwartz will take it here for Surrey. Back to the midpoint, Ross Rolison for Schwartz left wing side. Rolison gets the pass back in the middle to the right wing now, Jake Bongo, right circle shot, he scores. Jake Bongo's second goal of the hockey game from the right face-off circle let the shot go and it found its way through Katzen in. Bongo's got his second of the night, his sixth of the season with 8.15 to go in the third period. Surrey scores on the power play to make it 3-2. to two. Slid it back down low for Lorenz. Lorenz on the blocker side trying to play it back in front. Bouncing puck to Moriello will gather and clear it back to center. Ten seconds to go out of the box is Bernadette. 
Rollison on the right wing side. The Warriors to the power play. Right wing Moriello toward the empty goal. It hits a stick and bounces in. Jaden Moriello is going to get the goal into the empty net with 1.4 to go in the third period. And the Warriors are going to knock off the undefeated Surrey Eagles and hand them their first loss of the season. And Moriello put it off an Eagle defender's stick into the back of the net for his sixth goal of the season. It'll be a power play goal for the Warriors into the empty net, much like what we saw last night. And 4-2 the score with one second to go. The puck is down. That'll do it. The Surrey Eagles undefeated no more. A perfect week for the Warriors who go for four wins in a six-game span, or in a six-day span. And the Warriors knock off the Surrey Eagles tonight by a final score of 4-2. to two.